All right, guys, there's something fishy going on on the, the Roblox platform right now, and I figured I would talk about it. So I've been getting this ad a lot. Find any Roblox player available on Chrome. This is one of those Roblox stalking programs that uh, annoying people use to find me. Uh, a group of people that I want to put in a meat grinder and um, just watch it happen. Those are the people that install these apps. So I shouldn't even be defending them right now, but... So I'll click on this, and then what happens? Dramian 25's place, huh? One visit. This is odd. This doesn't. This doesn't really seem to have anything to do with the ad. It's just um. Huh. I think there's something fishy going on. I think um. I think a lot of people could possibly get hacked within the next week or so. You might be hearing about this. I might post this video too late to save anyone. I know I warn you guys of scams, but do not be worried that my merch coming out on August 31st is not a scam. I won't do anything horrible with your information. I am so trustworthy. Brazilian new designs. And I'm not in a new setup every other week because um, I'm fleeing the country uh, because of, you know, any type of scam I might be doing. Look me in the eyes. I wouldn't do anything bad. So like, I'll refresh a few more times and I will see that ad again, surely. Uh, all right, right here. Let's click on it. Are we gonna be, oh, Velexium's place. This is different. All right, here's the ad again. Whose place is, oh, be, be Patrice. All right, there's the ad again. Oh, Frogland. Why are all these people advertising the same thing on just blank games? Um, I asked. So we're gonna try to keep this blurred. Do not install this. I'm not accusing them of anything, but I'm saying that this might be a huge terrorist attack on Roblox. And the reason why I said uh, don't install any Roblox Chrome extensions, I should probably also say that. I'll go more into this later in the video, but there was a Chrome extension for Roblox similar to this. I think Rose Searcher and that 200,000 people's accounts were compromised from that. Like up to 200,000 people who have downloaded that possibly got hacked. Well, I'll go into that in a second. So I searched up the thing. It has 2,000 users and four stars almost of uh, reviews. So it looks pretty legit. There's all these reviews that vouch for it until um, uh, nine hours ago. Do not you Epic Match 4. Do not use the review actual people submit get removed because they complain about it being a virus or some type of malicious Chrome extension. It is! This extension will pop up a random two-step verification prompt for your code on the site that use it on advertisements for Road Tracker. So this is just one person saying this. This whole video is a theory. But hey! It's just a theory. If you don't have two-step authentication, then this can just access your account. And if, yeah. yeah. My review will probably be removed to hide this fact, but please do not use this. All the other reviews are from um, like two weeks ago and three weeks ago, then two days ago. Again, this is just a theory, but I think this might already be hacking people. Um, again, I don't know for sure. I'm just putting this out there because I've been seeing this ad almost every single time I refresh the page. Like why else would all these random accounts, and I I also, I found these for like 30 minutes and it's all different accounts. I have a list of like 30 accounts that were used for this. Notice one thing too. I've, I've been uh, sitting on this all night. Notice how the image, how the ad shifts a little bit every single time. This is so if one gets reported, it doesn't report all of them. If all of them are slightly different, they have to be individually reported. Does that make sense? Roblox has a system where if it if two images are identical and one gets deleted, that means the other one gets deleted too because they have it like approved in their system. Where if the images are like technically different, even if that just means it's a little bit zoomed in, if this one gets deleted, this is like a different image so that won't get deleted so i think he's a, what i'm saying is whoever made this is expecting all these ads to get reported so they have a thing that makes them all slightly different they're all on different accounts too and the developer of the app is unknown they have not identified themselves huh some un, i'm i'm gonna give an anonymous entity access to my computer oh cool the developer has disclosed that it will not collect or use your data well that settles that i Everybody install this now. 
install this now. And one of these people who had uh, one of these ads running, they said, I hate the person who changed my profile or hacked me. Look, I'm not accusing of this fella of doing anything evil, but I'm. Uh, what I'm saying is, well, there's hundreds of different anonymous accounts advertising your thing. Someone commented on this saying, um, they looked at the code and it doesn't seem malicious, but the same thing happened. The same thing happened to the search blocks one that had 200,000 people. It was a normal extension until, you know, after 200,000 people downloaded it, you know, someone added a little code that made it give you your password or something. People lost millions of Robux to this. Like thousands and thousands of real life dollars. And it was awesome. Annoying people who stalk me in game got hacked. Oh no. No, I'm just kidding. You don't deserve to be hacked. You just deserve to be, you just... <laughs> You know, it's sad to think, even if these people still have access to their accounts, um, if they weren't able to change these people's passwords, they still could get banned. Like, little boy could get banned. If you love God and you are not ashamed of it, little boy says, copy this, put it on your profile. Well, now little boy is going to hell because they got hacked and they don't even probably know it. Roblox hell. You know, it's sad if they get deleted. Does that also mean, uh, one less person to follow me around anytime I get a badge? Yes. Yes, that does mean that. If all of you get hacked, yeah, sure. Roblox would be a little bit easier for me to play, but I do not want that to happen is what I'm saying. Also, uh, on like the reviews end, I'm usually not one to take like some stranger on the internet's word, and I, I still am not, but um, it is strange how this is the only recent review. All of them were w within like a very specific, all on the same day, actually, besides two others. Yeah, there's a couple other people giving like um, accounts like giving th their statements kind of align with each other some of these people so i'm a little bit more inclined to trust that i'm not even really sure what can be done about this uh because roblox's moderation kind of sucks anyways especially with all these being slightly different they're not never really gonna catch all of them so yeah, it's probably gonna be a lot of uh, little kids that get hacked um probably a lot of normal people that get hacked too because it's kind of a smart scam maybe this video will help maybe it'll do nothing uh, this is another way that I see people get hacked kind of all the time. I figured I'll, I'll just throw this in. First off, don't download Discord. Why do you need to talk to people? Isolate yourself. I mean, people are evil is what I'm saying. So I guess these people were trying to make a trade on some Roblox game. And then uh, this guy sent him a link that looks like Roblox. Like it pops up Roblox right here. It's obviously not. So actually blur that out because I think that'll just get people hacked if they go to that. But basically it looks like it says Roblox.com but it doesn't. And then the person clicks it. Congratulations, you are the one billionth Roblox user. Enter your password to claim your prize. Okay, let's trade. Click link and join me. If link doesn't work, copy link, paste in Google. And join me, trade. Just join me. Please, I'm lonely. Probably offered him like a, like a really favorable trade and, you know, in his favor. So he went to the game. And then the next day, did you hack my account? So yeah, sometimes when you put like a certain link in, um, people could just steal your info, I guess, which is awesome. One of those Twitter bots uh, replied to this person, um, with another scam. If you type in, uh, I got hacked in the Twitter, a million bots will reply under your post saying, oh, go to this page to get unhacked. And it's just another thing that hacks you. I once had same issues, but am glad I got my account back. I feel it will be nice if render a little help. Contact this person on Instagram. He helped me recover my account. Then the person who originally posted this said, thank you. So he, he now just probably got his Twitter hacked too. So this guy can get your break. He keeps getting a uh, fool. You're a fool. Uh, yeah. Be paranoid. Carry a gun. Carry a knife. Carry more guns. Live in a bomb shelter. And um, create a fake name for yourself. These are all six tips to live by. And I, I so mean it. Guys, you know what isn't a scam? You can trust me with my money at my merch store. Uh, download my Google Chrome extension. You go to the website, there's a lot of stuff that you can, uh, 831 it comes out.